first told you as breaking news last night at 10 o'clock that a major development was coming in the case of a little boy found dead on a beach in Galveston. Well, this morning we learned what that development was and boy, it was a bombshell. The boy police called little Jacob since the discovery of the body last year has been identified. He is four year old Jaden Alexander Lopez and two arrests have been made in connection with his death. The boy's mother and her girlfriend. Channel 2 Sophia Beausoleil live in Southwest Houston where authorities have arrested the mother. Sophia? Dominique, it was a tip back in March that led authorities to this apartment complex right here where they arrested the mother along with the girlfriend and they've now been charged with tampering or fabricating evidence. No one knew who he was, so authorities called him little Jacob, but now we can put a name to a face. No one reported Jaden as missing. No one was looking for Jaden. Jaden had no advocate other than us. Four-year-old Jaden Alexander Lopez's body washed up on a beach in Galveston last October. Court documents say a tip led police and FBI agents to Jaden's mother, 34-year-old Rebecca Rivera, and her girlfriend, 31-year-old Dania Gomez, who both live in Houston. As soon as I seen a pigeon, I was like, yeah, that's her. Brian Hutchinson lives in Missouri City and says he didn't know her well, but Rebecca Rivera used to be his neighbor. It's just sad to know that a little child's life no longer is here because of two, <laughs> two women. Court records say in April, Rivera initially told police her son was kidnapped, but on Tuesday told investigators that two weeks before Jaden died, he bumped his head into a wall. The mother says she used alcohol to clean the injury, but she and her girlfriend argued and the bottle spilled on the boy's face. His health started to deteriorate. He complained of stomach aches and two weeks later, she says he died. The court documents state Rivera said she, her girlfriend and her other young son drove to Galveston in the middle of the night and she put Jaden's body into the water. Authorities believe the four year old died before he entered the ocean, but they don't know what exactly he died from. But autopsy reports showed signs of neglect and injuries consistent with abuse. And when investigators asked the mother why she didn't take Jaden to the hospital, she said she was concerned that he, along with his brother, would be taken away from her. Now, we did talk to Child Protective Services. They say they have worked with Vera in the past. They didn't go into details, but they did tell us that her youngest son is in custody of CPS. Reporting live from Southwest Houston, Sophia Bosley, KPRC, Channel 2 News.